637 now happening today. It is back to school for Roanoke County Public Schools. While families prepared at home, 10 News reporter Megan Woods joins us live from Mountain View Elementary School with how teachers prepared in the classroom for a year that will be unlike any other, Megan. Yes, that's right. Unlike any other, the buildup for the first day of school is usually a big deal, but because the students and teachers haven't seen each other until March, it'll uh, since March, it'll definitely be different. Now, since we've been here, we've already seen quite a few teachers arrive and students will be arriving within the next half an hour, 45 minutes. And so when we say first day of school, that means pre-K through second graders will be arriving, but also the first group of third through 12th graders. Teachers have been preparing long before to make sure they met guidelines like desks at least six feet apart, ensuring no shared supplies, limiting class sizes, even developing a system using magnets to track bathrooms that need to be cleaned after use. The school district says parents also play a key role in prevention. We sent home a magnet with a health checklist. We ask that parents review that checklist every single morning before sending their children to school. It has a number of questions on there like, do you have a fever? Do you have a new cough? Have you been exposed to somebody with COVID? Many, several different questions. Chuck says if your child has any of those symptoms, they should not be going to school. They should stay at home and you need to call a doctor. Now that checklist is also on the school district's website. Live in Roanoke County, Megan Woods, 10 News, working for you.